Stay in the zone during your next esports tournament or give yourself a pick me up during late night gaming sessions and punishing live streams with quantum energy. Created for gamers by gamers, the sugar free energy drink offers a balanced blend to give you a noticeable boost of energy without the nasty crash. Quantum energy drink is easy to carry around during gaming conventions or while you're on the road. There's no need to lug around heavy cans, this compact and lightweight tub fits easily into a backpack. Use the link in the description and when you check out the code GD for 10% off all orders. Hello YouTube, it's Dallas here and welcome back to the Neymar Project episode 2 boys. Today, it's a big episode. It is a very, very big episode. As you can see on the screen right now, we went and completed David Beckham mid and we were able to complete him for free boys so you know we used fodder that we had in the club we didn't use any coins and we got him for free so you're gonna see where we play him we're obviously not playing you know on the wing we're gonna be playing him as, as a central midfielder and as you can see right there he did play for psg 14 games so he is eligible to play in the neymar project you're also going to see a ton of packs also in this video we've got Packs on Beckham, as you can see, being open now. We've got some objective packs. We're going to be ripping some packs with FIFA points, as we can do now on the name of Project. It's no more a poor man. You know, we're free to spend as much FIFA points as we want to. You're also going to see our rival rewards, which was only a 100k pack because we're still not in elite division. But we'll get there probably in two weeks minimum. We'll be in elite division. Maybe next week we will. At the moment, I'm Div 2 rank 1. Oh, sorry, Div 1 rank 1. So, you know, we basically need to win three games in a row and we're in the elite division. So, you know, we are close to the elite division again. And as soon as we get there, it's going to be important, you know, because the rewards are way better than in Div 1. And you're also going to see our new team. The improvements that we did to a team, we're going to go through our custom tactics. I'm trying to use a new formation. And we're going to use this new team in some co-op games as well. So, yeah, it is going to be an action-packed video. And, you know, the name of project at the moment is going very, very good. I'm, I'm excited. I'm very, very excited. You know, I'm rejuvenated in terms of, you know, making a series. So, you know, boys, I'm looking forward to the possibilities, which are, are literally endless with this name of project because the teams that we can make are going to be absolutely phenomenal and use players that, you know, necessarily we wouldn't, we wouldn't use. So let's now get into our new squad, boys. All right, boys, so... This is our new team going in to the weekend league. Most likely, we are also going to be playing some co-op matches in this video. So, this is what we've upgraded with the team. Bang. As you can see, there are some new acquisitions into the side. The defense stays exactly the same. At the moment, we have Inform Navas, who has been pretty good. He's been pretty good. He's been... Way better than Donnarumma. Donnarumma for me was absolutely useless. Against me, he's the greatest goalkeeper ever. I don't know how that happens. But yeah, for me, he's absolutely shocking. But this Navas is not bad. He can have some moments of brilliance. So, you know, Verratti and Wijnaldum stay in. But at the moment, we're brought in Laudrup. Now, he has been phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. Playing the camp position, uh, basically, at the whole time. I am going to show you a new custom tactics that I am going to be using in this video that I want to try out. I want to try out, you know, before the weekend league. But at the moment, he has been playing the cam position. 22 games, 16 goals, 8 assists. So a phenomenal, phenomenal return from him. He's so good. He's actually unbelievable. He's rapid. He's got phenomenal dribbling. He's got incredible passing. The only thing is, is his finishing. His finishing at times can be brilliant. At times can be shocking. Um, so yeah, you know, like, not, I wouldn't say shocking, he just misses shots that sometimes he scores, you know, it's very inconsistent because of that 74, even at an 84, still, sometimes he does miss chances that he sometimes does score, so you know, it is a bit inconsistent in there, but we've got him because he's played 216 games for Barcelona, you know, he won four La Ligas with them, a Champions League with them in Cruyff's dream team, really, you know. So, you know, Laudrup was a big, big player for Barcelona and one of the best players, you know, in his generation. So, you know, Laudrup comes into the side. Then you can also see we have completed David Beckham. 
he played for PSG as well, so you know, he's eligible for the uh, Neymar project, really. So Beckham comes in, we play him as a central midfielder, and as you can see, with his stats for a central midfielder, it's, it's phenomenal, no? You know, he's quick, he's got shooting, he's got probably some of the best passing stats, and so he should, you know, it's David Beckham. Decent dribbling, you know, his agility lets him down, but on the ball, you know, he's got great dribbling with 85, 91 ball control, so, you know, no donkey touches, and then physicality, 91 stamina, 75 strength, 79 aggression, you know, phenomenal, phenomenal central midfielder, and he's got finesse shot trade, outside of foot trade, and early crosser as well, so Bex comes in, and I'll show you where we play him in our team, Alex Tuxeria comes in, if you know last year, he was a cult figure for the start of the year, he comes in and 10 games, 3 goals, 8 assists. He's really playing slick and fiddle to name a loud drip. However, you know, he's not a donkey. He, he feels phenomenal on the ball as well. And he's got the stats, 90 uh, agility, 86 ball control, 85 um, dribbling, you know, 93 finishing and 85 shot power with, you know, basically max pace. He's got 78 strength as well. So, you know, he doesn't feel weak on the ball. So he comes in. And now, I've showed you my 4 one 2 2 narrow settings already, uh, sorry, tactics, but what I am using at the moment, and I want to try out, is a false 9. So, we have pressure on heavy touch as a defensive style, 45 width, 70 depth, I want this to be extremely high pressure, you know, that's why a 4-3-3 four, three, three is played, you know, to be extremely... Uh, aggressive. I've got slow build up because it's a 4 3 3, especially with a false nine. You know, you want to play a bit slow as well, play a bit of you know your triangles and then forward runs to get you know the players in behind with 70 players in the box five corners, two free kicks, two. Now, the instructions are completely different, like it is completely different, really. Um, my full backs have got to stay back. My goalkeeper got come for cross the sweeper keeper. But where it gets different is the CDM cover center standard positioning free roam. So you know he's just gonna be picking Verratti's just gonna be picking up pockets, you know, in our attack. He's got the passing, he's got the dribbling. So you know, free roam, and I've got him on stay back. The free roam boys, you'll see in the gameplay, hopefully, how he just picks up balls, you know, not from that central position. He always find space drifts into the open space to receive it we've got david beckham get forward free roam as well so one him you know picking up those positions floating around when i nail them i have stay on the edge of box or crosses and basically everything else balance i should i was thinking about get you know stay back but i think the balance is fine with his high high so you know i'm, I'm not defensively open because technically we don't want to let the opponent be on the ball match, you know, we want to win that ball back as soon as possible So, you know, we don't really need him on stay back. We don't need two Midfielders stay back. Just Verratti is fine. Then on our, both our wingers, we've got cut inside, get him behind Neymar, I've got conservative because I just don't want him to gas as much, you know, he's our main player So, you know, I don't want to sub him, so the conservative just conserves that stamina a little bit But the Shady, I'll just have it interceptions on balance so yeah, Neymar cut inside, get in behind, same as Tixeria. And then Laudrup, I basically have not touched anything. I just want him to play that center forward position. So yeah, boys, this is the new tactic that I am going to be using. I don't know if I'm going to go into the weekend league, but we'll see today with our court matches how this formation goes. So boys, without further ado, let's get into some gameplay. All right. <laughs> What a ball! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Is he a striker? He's the winger. No man, that is deflection aids man. What is rebound goal boost your man? He's guessing it man. Neymar! Good. Back post. <gasps> what a ball! <laughs> <laughs> What's Verratti doing in there, man? Right, this 4 3 3 is actually Zumi. Right, this guy doesn't know what, what's hitting, man. He's got like 20 people in his penalty box. He's got Verratti in his penalty box, man. <laughs> Green! 
grind it. I grind it as well. <laughs> I'm telling, bro. This four three three is lethal. We are all over him, man. Oh yeah, soup water save. Yeah, he's out of here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's it, boys. First game, what a win! Yeah, <laughs> 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 you know what, with all these players, you know who I'm most worried about? Fakir. What am I witnessing, bro? Immediately, man. It's like icons have a special power, man. Nah. Nah. Blanc. <laughs> That's just R9. No, no one hits the baller like that. In this game, so that just says it all. Yeah, that just says it all. Good backs. No, this if this thing does not miss, man. This thing does not miss. This thing just does not miss, eh? He shoot. Look at his shooting, bro. Like a rocket's man. He knuckles balls. Eh? Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, twinkle toes, Allison. Ah, oh, twinkle toes, twinkle toes, Tora. Look at him. Look at this coward! Look at him! With his multi billion dollar team, the dog! I'm gonna send this cockroach a message, man! I'm gonna send this cockroach a message, man! Very dominant, very dominant! Yeah, you rat, man! You're a rat! You're a rat, man! You are garbage! If you don't have R9 and every bounce coming back to you, man, you lose that game! You lose that game without your multi-billion dollar team, you peasant. You're a peasant, man. You're the equivalent to my toenail clippings, your dog. You're a peasant. You, my friend, very dominant, are the biggest peasant I've ever seen, man. You scum. Why now, them? Bang. Genie one album. Genie one album. The cherry is so good. Genie one album has got two. Genie one album has two. <laughs> He's out of it. Man, I just waited 45 minutes for a game and his rage quit. Oh, man. Oh, man. Far out. What, well, boys? That is all I reckon we're going to be playing today because it's like 4, four o'clock in the morning, but... Uh, we waited for so long. Hey, we got the win though. We got the win. Always positivity. We did get the win. So let's now get into our rival rewards. All right, boys. On the screen, we are opening up our 100k pack from rivals. We took the tradable pack and it paid off big time. It really, really did. We got Marco Royce, first of all. 
then bang, we get an inform, so that's like 16k right there, and then bang, we get campaign by 40k, so we end up doing way better choosing the tradable 100k pack, than, you know, taking an untradable K, uh, 100k pack and 30k, so it did turn out good, it turned out the right decision, Kempembe is big, 40k in the bank with Royce and the inform, so yeah boys, as you saw, you know, we were trying out the 433 in co-ops, and it played well, it did play well, it was extremely aggressive, and I feel like the best situation to use the 433, you know, with these tactics, are against players who are not good, the players who are worse than you and you activate that custom tactic so you're in their face you're winning that ball high up and they're not able to get the ball you know one or two times in the whole match and you know jam a goal jam the win you know what i mean through dda what what i noticed with the 433 was against those players that we should win, we win because of how aggressive it is and you end the game immediately. As you saw, you know, against those players who you should be beating, you win the game in the first half. So yeah, boys, very, very effective. I do recommend you to try it out. Anyway, boys, just quickly before the video ends, I will not be streaming on, you know, today on Friday because I have an exam the next day. However, I will be aiming to stream late Sunday night or Monday during the day. So do stay tuned. Make sure you've subscribed to the channel. Turn on the notification bell so you know when I am subscribing. And as always, boys, remember, relax, have a year off, and I'll be back in the next video.